and welcome back to my channel. Welcome to Primark haul. I normally do these every single month but obviously due to coronavirus and lockdown it's been shut and it's been open for probably would you say a month now? Probably around a month and I haven't gone yet mainly because the Primark in Brighton when it first opened it was literally like on the news because there was queues going all up streets and stuff like that and I just thought no <laughs> not gonna happen so I've waited like a good few weeks now and I thought okay I've got that urge now to go into Primark get as many bits and pieces that I absolutely love and share them with you all. I've also chosen to film this video on one of the hottest days ever it's over 30 degrees like 100% I know in some countries that's not hot at all but in England I literally have a handheld fan right here because so hot I'm just gonna I'm just gonna do this for a while you know this is so nice oh. it also feels so nice to be sitting down and just filming like a sit down video obviously at the moment I've been doing a lot of moving vlogs on my channel which I absolutely love and it's weird because normally I do sit down videos but it's moving I've done more vlogs which I absolutely love doing it's just it's weird but I'm gonna combine the two onto my channel because it's what I like and what you guys like watching too so it's just a win-win if you haven't already please do make sure you subscribe to my channel and also hit the little bell to be notified on every single time I upload and also come and say hi to me over on Instagram I'm gonna be posting pictures of the outfits and stuff that I've shown in today's video over on my Instagram page. And don't you worry, these are definitely going to be monthly videos again because I've missed them far too much. So if you want to see all the bits and pieces that I got from Primark, which there's a lot of good stuff in there at the moment, then please keep watching. Okay, so I always say this in every haul. I'm literally just going to pick things out of the bag and show you. I'm not going to do it in any order or anything like that. Not that fancy. I'm just going to pick things up and show you. First thing that's come out of the bag is a shower cap. Um, I always well I used to wear shower caps in the flat all the time they're just so handy because you don't have to like put your hair in a bun you can just sort of put all your hair in the shower cap and it doesn't make your curls go all distorted or anything like that and since we moved I couldn't find the shower cap anywhere so I picked this one up it's very much mermaid vibes as you can see but they're just really cute and it was only a pound so love that. next thing is this headband now <laughs> well this is actually you kind of need to be sturdy with this and um, this was three pounds I just thought this is such a cute headband I don't know when I'll wear it but I just thought it's really cute like I don't know I just really liked it Do you know when you see something you're like I don't know when I'm gonna Ow. anyway I was thinking I'm not sure when I'm gonna wear it but I just want it I really like it it is quite like flimsy though um, but maybe that's a good thing I don't know I picked up this top which is actually similar to the top I'm wearing now the material is a little bit different though um, and it's more of like a peplum style top so it's got the puff sleeves square neckline and then it just goes out at the bottom sort of the tummy area which is the area I hate personally on myself the most so when I saw this I was like oh my god because a lot of these tops that have the square necklines sorry turn my phone off a lot of the tops are crop tops and I'm just not really a fan of crop tops unless I wear like really high-waisted shorts or something like that and you can sort of get away with it but personally for me I just don't feel comfortable so when I saw this I was like oh, perfect and it was only eight pounds so yeah I'm yet to see what it looks like on but I think it is just a really lovely top and it's just that sort of jersey comfy material as well and it's that crisp white. Um, so yeah, I really like that. The next thing I picked up were these earrings. They were only two pounds. I love gold earrings, you guys know. I'm just such a huge fan of accessories, mainly earrings. I just feel like it dresses up your outfit and just makes everything look so much better. Um, so these are like smaller than the gold sort of earrings I've got at the moment. So I just thought these are good. If I want to wear earrings but not ones that are a bit too much, do you know what I mean? I'm so excited about this. Um, they've got loads of like wintry bits in which is so odd. And that's one thing about Primark that I don't think I'll ever really understand. I get a lot of shops have to be in front of themselves for seasons, but like it's July and there's loads of like winter stuff. I saw it and I was like, what? But I still bought it anyway. Um, so I found this cardigan, it was nine pounds um, and it looks like this. It's really soft and it's just the sort of cardigan that is just gonna be nice just to throw on on top of an outfit. Loads of my cardigans now are really thick and they're like wool. <laughs> they're literally like 
thick material. So sometimes if I want to get cozy in the evenings, I have to wear like always my thin dressing gown, which is like my summer dressing gown because all my cardigans are too thick. So I saw this and I thought this is really good for any season um, and it sort of droops at the front like this. It's sort of like dressing gown style, but it's not, it's a cardigan um, and I really like the colour. So yeah, you'll see that on, but I'm really, really obsessed with this. I feel like it's just nice and cozy. I am just in love with this, literally in love. I picked up this cardigan. Can we just take a moment? Look at those sleeves. So they've got beautiful puff sleeves and the buttons are gold and it looks like this. I just could, like this is just me in a cardigan. Sometimes I just wanna wear like a cami top or a vest or just a plain top and I sort of wanna dress it up with a nice cardigan or a blazer or something like that. But I just think this is just beautiful. I just love the puff sleeves on it. The detailing is just insane as well. So I literally love that. And then this was eight pounds. It's just so good. Okay, so some hair pieces. Um, I picked up loads of scrunchies. Now, before I go to bed, I always put my hair in a low ponytail, but I can't use proper hair bands like this because it makes the curls go all distorted and then there's always a kink. But, little tip, if you use scrunchies, because they're silky and they're really soft, they don't make the curls go funny. So honestly, I put one in my hair every single night before I go to bed. I done it last night and I haven't even curled my hair properly today and it's obviously a little bit more wavier, but it honestly works. So a little tip, I always get them from Primark as well. I think they're the nicest and also the cheapest as well. Um, so I've got more corally colours. For summer, I thought they're cute. And then these ones. I also wear them like if I go to the gym or something like that as well. Um, but yeah, I just thought they're cute. I picked up these sunglasses. They were £3. Um, I didn't properly try them on. Oh, I actually really like them. Really like them. Oh my god. They also had them in like a nude, but they didn't really suit me the nude. Oh my god. New face sunnies. Literally love them. As weird as it sounds, I always feel like when you go to somewhere like Primark or places like that to get sunglasses, they're never as big as you want. I like big sunglasses. So yeah, oh my god, literally love them. Three pounds. So good. Um, and yeah, they also had like nude frames as well. I also picked up a hair wrap. This was £1.50. These are really, really good to pop on your hair when you're doing your skincare. I know some people do their makeup with them, but I always do my hair and then my makeup, so it doesn't really make sense for me to do it for that. But I always like to do it before I do my skincare, and it honestly really helps just to hold all your hair out of your face. Um, so yeah, these are really good. And they're also really really stretchy so perfect for any head size really and um, so that is £1.50. The next purchase oh my god these were £8 I'm just obsessed so they look like wedges but they're flat they're like espadrille sort of wedge style um, but they've got the same like look as a wedge with the strap around the ankle. I've actually got ones from Primark, which I wear all the time and they're gold and they're the most comfortable shoes ever. If I want to dress up and wear heels, but be comfortable like in the summer, I always wear them, always. So the fact that they've got them in like the flat style, I was like, oh my God. And they also had them in black as well. Kind of wish I put the black up, but I thought for summer, these would definitely go with more. So in them, I got them in a size six, um, and they were eight pounds. So yeah, really like them. This is what they look like up close. They're just really lovely. So yeah, happy to see what these look like with like cute white dresses and stuff like that. Another pair of shoes I got, which <laughs> I'm obsessed with are these. Um, they were six pounds. I got them in a size seven. I don't know why, every time I get like sandals or sliders, I always get them in a seven, but I'm usually a six. I don't know why, I feel like the sixes look too small. I don't know. But anyway, they look like this. I just love the detailing on them. I love the silver going around the edge. And I picked them up and I thought, oh, do I need them? Because I've got some like similar. And then I was like, no, no, no. And then it's the last size and I was like, fine. So um, I picked them up and I just think they're beautiful. And just easy ones to slip on in the house as well, especially for six pounds. 
I think they had other styles too, so yeah. Okay, so my camera just overheated because it is that hot. Like normally it takes a while to overheat, but no, not today. But anyway, I was saying those sandals are just so lovely. And just so lovely just to throw on every day. Love that. I also picked up this. It was £2.50. Um, this is in like the pyjama section. So it looks like a vest, but inside this part where your boobs go, it's got like hidden support. So I literally live in not sports bras. I'll show you the bras that I live in, comfy bras, on a day-to-day -day basis. Like obviously I'm wearing a proper bra today, but on days where I'm at home, I'm slouching, I don't really need to wear a proper bra, but I probably should wear one. I wear like, they're like sports bras. But sometimes when you feel like you need the extra support, um, yeah, it's got the hidden part here, which I think is just so handy and adjustable straps as well, which is really good. And I just love this color gray. I really love it. So I got this um, and I thought I could like mix and match with the pajamas. So the first set of pajamas I got were these. So they were 10 pounds each for the bottoms and the top. It's Primark's organic cotton. So I'm guessing that's why it was just a couple of pounds more. Um, so I picked up some joggers. First of all, how lovely are they? They've actually got a drawstring that works, which is brilliant because I hate it when they put fake ones on and you're like, oh, why is this even here? <laughs> like, it's literally doing nothing. So that's handy. Obviously it's got pockets. Um, I love this color gray and then it goes all the way down and that's the bottoms. Um, so yeah, they look up like that and they're just really like, the quality is really good. And then it came, obviously you had to buy it separately, but this little top, it's sort of like a jumpery top. Um, it's just a bit more oversized, but comfortable. Um, so that's a little set. Um, and I thought on days when it's a bit hotter, I can just pop the vest on, which is good. So I love that. And then the other pair of pajamas I got, I'm just obsessed. If this doesn't scream like Santorini, I don't know what it does. Okay, so these are the bottoms. Does the drawstring work? No, it doesn't work. I, don't, I really don't understand this. Like, what is the point if it doesn't work? Um, anyway, it's got really cute pockets. Um, and then it literally just goes out like that. So they're like floaty bottoms. And then I got a dressing gown as well, which is really like thin material which is ideal for summer because I love popping a dressing gown on in the morning it's while I'm getting ready and stuff like after you've had a shower it's just nice to pop your dressing gown on before you sort of decide what to wear um so this is a thin one it's got like three quarter sleeves but really cute I'll show you the set on and then I also got a little like cami top and it's got adjustable straps as well so I thought that was a really cute little set it also came with a top that had I think it had like short sleeves or something I can't remember but I prefer cami tops like this so how cute is that and the print is just lovely and it's just really really lovely material oh I love these Um, I picked up some trousers they were 13 pounds and they look like this now I'm not sure about the color I don't know if the color is a little bit like weird for my skin tone does that make sense? I always feel like sometimes wearing a colour like this can wash me out a little bit and I can look a bit weird. Um, it's got pockets. But they're just floaty trousers. It, they also came in, I think it was khaki or blue. I can't remember. One of the two. Um, but I don't know, I just opted for these ones. And they've also got an elasticated back. So they're super comfy and stretchy and will look good with like a little cami top um, and a blazer or something like that. But yeah, I thought these were really lovely. Oh, I'm so happy about these. Um, I also picked up some shorts. They look like this. They're just plain black shorts, but they're floaty. They've got an elasticated waist, and I love wearing these. I've got some of these in like a nude from Pretty Little Thing, and it always annoyed me why they didn't do other colours, but I found black, and they've got little pockets as well. Um, they're really cute, and they sort of look really lovely with just like a white top, um, and again, like a little jacket or cardi or something over the top as well. So yeah, these are sort of ones you can dress up or down, um, or even to the beach, like literally anywhere. I also got some slippers to go with my new pajamas because you know, tonight I am definitely getting into them pajamas and these slippers, even though it is absolutely boiling outside, but I'm still gonna do it. Um, they were only four pounds. I always go a size up in slippers just because, I don't know, I find them a bit, a bit cozy. I don't want my feet to be too like snug. Do you know what I mean? Um, so yeah, literally four pounds and they're really thick 
as well. So they're going to be really good, I think. I'm really soft. Picked up some knickers. <laughs> um, I don't know about you. I absolutely love Brazilian knickers. They're just the most comfiest knickers ever. All my knickers are from Primark. And I'm not ashamed to say that. Like, who cares? Um, but the Brazilian style is definitely my favourite. So, yeah, they're so comfortable. Silky and, yeah, love them. Not much to say about knickers, but these are great. Okay, so these are the sort of bras I was talking about earlier. You get three in a packet and they're £10. Um, they're just called Everyday Comfort Wireless Bras. And it's got removable padding inside. So if you don't want the padding, you can take it out. You can be free. Um, and they're just so comfortable. I wish it was like black, white and grey all in a set. So you have to buy three whites, three black, and it's just a bit annoying. Um, but they are really comfortable. They've got adjustable straps as well. Um, and I wear these all the time. I picked up some false nails. I have just done my nails. I literally done them yesterday. But I thought on days where I really need to go out, my nails aren't done, I could just put some stick-ons on. During lockdown, I literally just wore stick-ons that my sister done, and it was amazing. Um, but then last night, I just thought, I'm gonna do my own nails, because it's getting to the point where I stuck them on so much that the glue had like risen in the stick-on, and it was just easy to come off. Um, so yeah, I got these ones. How cute are they with the gold tips? I just think they look really pretty. So yeah, they're £1.50. And just, I think they look really nice. I also picked up these. These are just sort of pearl bracelets. I wouldn't wear them all together. But I think I'd wear just a couple, like, with my jewellery now. So it was only a pound. I don't know, I just thought they looked quite cute. I really like pearls. I'm a pearl kind of person. Like, even my earrings, I've got loads of pearls on. So I like pearls. So yeah, I thought it'd be nice to sort of mix and match my jewellery on my hands at the moment with some of these. Okay, I'm not going to lie to you. The home bit... I don't know if it's just our Primark, but it was crap. Honestly, I was trying to find stuff so I could show you, but we haven't got any new candles in. It's all the old like branding of the candles. I've seen other Primark calls and there's new candles and stuff, and I'm like, why is that not in our one? So hopefully it'll come soon. Um, so I didn't want to get stuff just for the sake of it, because I always film it. So next time I go in, hopefully there'll be loads of new home bits. Um, but a thing I did get from the home was this. Now I thought this is really nice because, again, I'm that person that loves aesthetic to all match. Um, so this is the Primark Home Self Dispensing Dish Brush. Brush, dish, dish brush. <laughs> That's a tongue twister. And what you do is you put your washing up liquid in here and then you attach the sponge to the end and you can just wash up a lot easier. Um, and then I also picked up some refills which were only pound, so. Yeah, and this was one pound fifty. I got some nail buffers. This was one pound. You get two in here. Um, sometimes they're just really good when you're doing your own nails, just to make sure they're all nice and shiny. And the last couple of bits, I picked up some socks. I always need these. I swear, every Primark, I always every Primark, every Primark haul, I always get socks. But mainly because Bradley steals them. Even these ones, I try and get the brightest colours, and he still takes them. Um, but these are really good for the gym. They're breathable, so they've got little holes in them. Obviously, they're meant to have holes in them. Uh, it just helps your feet breathe, especially in the summer if you're in trainers or anything like that as well. Um, so yeah, they were three pounds. So I definitely got the wrong size though, so a bit annoying. Oh dear. And then last thing I got from Primark Home was this lunch bag. I know I don't have any children. These are like what children have. But me and Bradley like going on our picnics and stuff like that. So I just thought if we've got like a little picnic, we're going somewhere for the day, we've got to take lunch or something, I could just pop our lunches in here because it's like a cool bag as well. Um, and obviously it's marble. And I just thought it's quite cute. I so think I'm a kid, don't I? But I don't know, I liked it. So if you are a mum and you've got kids and you want them to get a nice lunchbox, this is in Primark. Um, how much was it? Two pounds. And they had another one as well, but I've heard this one. So my lovelies, I am gonna conclude the video off here. I really hope you guys enjoyed it. Honestly, it feels so nice to be back filming like proper sit down videos again and obviously Primark calls again because they're back. I also went to Poundland that same day. So there might be a Poundland haul coming as well. And honestly, the amount of stuff I got from Poundland was crazy and there was some incredible pieces in there, like literally 
insane. So make sure you are subscribed so you know when I upload that video as well. But anyway, I hope you guys have enjoyed this video. Thank you so much for watching. Come and say hi to me over on my Instagram page. And hopefully I can see you all in my next video. Bye. Darling, you've got to keep holding on through the night. Cause I promise you this.